We move to the all weather for race number five. It's over the 1,650 metres. It's class four and Sky Supreme comes back in trip. He's a four time winner over this distance. All joyful and excuse first up, the saddle shifted. Mission Bravo wears blinkers again. Fast pace has placed second up and also has a placing on the all weather from Limited Goes. Son of McPhee. He struggled over 1,800 last time, should like the drop back in trip. The Multiplier is a last start winner in Class 5 on this surface, so it comes up in grade. Luckstar, two starts on the all weather for a third and a fourth this season, and is trained by a king of the dirt, Benno Jungtop. He is. Uh, the stable's been flying on the all weather. Uh, Sky Supreme produced uh, a much better performance last uh, time out, and it was only headed in the shadows by the inform at Righteous Doctrine. Green Laser, the 12 start maiden, uh, might be handy, but he was a long way back from a wide draw last time out, but this time. He's got barrier three. Uh, Beauty Champ's got a lot of gear changes. Peak to peak, uh, Paul comes to the all weather for the first time and it's not going to find it easy from 11. No, and Mission Bravo likewise. I think he'll try and slot in just in behind him and try and get some cover. Fast pace, we've seen him, him lead uh, plenty of times over longer trips. I think he'll try and just slot in there midfield. Our first replay, Paul, features Sky Supreme. Did a good job over 1800 last time, whereas Son of McPhee was not as savage as what he's been up the straight over the 1650. So the drop back in trip should be ideal for him. Yeah, I like him uh, back to 1650, definitely. You can see him coming uh, out wide here, but he just didn't finish off the race, did he? Sky Supreme, uh, look, he, he fought on strongly here. He's got to, um, he's got a little bit of a weight relief for Victor Wong aboard, but still got a, he's up on weight. He just held his ground there, uh, Son of McPhee, uh, right through the, the final stages there. To be fair to him, he did have a, a little bit of a, a tough run, but uh, agree with Paul and Mark that coming back to 16. 50 should much uh, be better suited for him this time round. Good report for son of McPhee with the shorter trip. The multiplier, Tommy, was impressive last time in Class 5. He's he's had a trial since, but can he go back to back? Well, he's got an ordinary record in this grade, but look, I think he can because I think he might have sort of found his mark and his level here in Hong Kong. He's been back to the trial since and he ran third and to look to do it uh, really well uh, there uh, late on the all weather, which was uh, wet. And he was hard ridden, but uh, he responded and responded strongly, Paul. Yeah, so maybe he's just, uh, he's just sort of clicked for him as well. Uh, look, I'm going to include include him. He's um, he won nicely enough, as you say. His record in the grade's not particularly good, but uh, he's in form now. Now a trial here, Paul, from Surrealism. Just his second look on the surface. The horse that wins this trial is Hurry Hurry Rich, who went like a jet. So he's beaten margin. If you're just reading, will show quite some distance. But the winner was miles in front. He was, wasn't he? Look, the, he did a nice, uh, quiet trial here for uh, Surrealism. Again, he's drawn a little bit awkward, awkwardly in barrier number ten. Uh, for him, look, I haven't included him, but the trial, there was nothing wrong with the trial. He's a seven-year-old who's a one-time winner mm. from 42 starts. Um, trial was OK, but you can deal me out. OK, so it's enough for Tom. <laughs> 19 and 4 is his early price of surrealism. Do we go uh, son of McPhee here, Paul? Uh, I've gone with him, yeah. I like him back to 16.50. I think uh, it's good for him. He, he sort of, uh, as Tom said, he sort of had a bit of a hard run last time. I think back and triple will suit him. Uh, Luck Star has run two good races here on the all-weather. I'm going to put Green Laser in. I know he's still a maiden, but I think he can be a little bit handier this time from a good barrier draw and the multiplier in there for fourth. Eight, ten, eleven and nine. Yeah, eight on top three as well. Uh, that is uh, Son of McPhee coming back in trip here. I think it's uh, certainly going to suit him more this time round. So I've got the 10 in, and that is uh, Luxton. He was beyond midfield and looked to improve wider coming off the back straight. And probably after he loomed up in the straight, peaked on his run, he's had a trial since it was fairly quiet. The multiplier goes in, and Sky Supreme will see how long he can hang on for in the straight. To look like he's uh, ready to give up the gauntlet and throw it uh, down uh, to run third, but in the end, fought back for second. So 8, 10, 9 and one. And for six up punters, race five is your first leg.